Hey guys, today I'm going to show you some useful keyboard shortcuts for uTorrent. The first one is Control O. That allows you to add a torrent to the program. Control D also allows you to add a torrent. However, with Control D, it allows you to choose the save directory as well. Next is Control U. That allows you to add a torrent from a URL. Control N goes to create new torrent. Control P opens preferences. Under preferences, we have general, UI settings, directories, connection, bandwidth, BitTorrent, transfer cap, queuing, scheduler, remote, playback, paired devices, label, and advanced. Control R opens the RSS downloader. Control G opens the setup guide. F4 or FN and F4 will show or hide the toolbar. As you can see, if I press it once, the toolbar disappears, and if I press it again, it's going to show up again. F5, or FN and F5, will show or hide detailed information. So if I press it once, it's going to hide the detailed information, and if I press it again, it's going to show up. F6, or FN and F6, will show or hide the status bar. So if I press it once, it disappears. Press it again, it shows up again. F7, or FN and F7, will show or hide the sidebar. If I press it once, the sidebar is going to disappear, and if I press it again, it's going to show up. F8, or FN and F8, will hide or show bundles. F11, or FN and F11, will narrow the toolbar, and if I press it again, it's going to go back. F12, or FN and F12, will compact the category list. So as you can see, it makes it a bit more compact. And if I press it again, it's going to go back to normal. And the last one I want to show you guys is F1, or FN and F1. And that's going to open uTorrent Help. So those were some useful keyboard shortcuts for uTorrent. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll see you in my next video.